American Movie Classics presents a gripping story of corruption, The Turning Point, Monday on AMC. confining but never dull in Stalag 17. The boys were up to something new every minute. There were the races every afternoon. The dance on Saturday night. Did anybody ever tell you you had the most beautiful legs in the world? The cocktail hour when the bar was open. <coughs> what are you serving today? Nitric acid! And if you think everything was roses, it wasn't. Stalag 17 was a hellhole where no man ever escaped alive. One of us is a stoolie, a dirty, stinking stoolie. One of them a German spy reporting every move to von Scherbach, the commandant. One of them a hunted fugitive as the Nazis turned Stalag 17 inside out and upside down to find him. One of them a big time operator who played the million to one shot. Tunneling out of Stalag 17. Just one more word. If I ever run into any of you bums on a street corner, just let's pretend we never met before. Next on EMC, William Holden gives an Academy Award-winning performance as a prisoner in a POW camp who does what he has to do just to survive in Stalag 17, directed by Billy Wilder. Next on EMC. And now the beginning of William Holden Week here on AMC, and let's start off with Stalag 17, a film by the great Billy Wilder. There actually was a Stalag 17. The real POW camp was located in Austria, and it was originally brought to fictional life by the playwriting team of Edwin Blum and Edmund Trzinski. Now, the play opened late in the 1950-51 theatrical season with virtually no advanced sales and no real bankable stars. But at least one audience member saw possibilities in this play, and it only had a moderate Broadway success, so he was just in time, and that was Billy Wilder, who bought the rights for $50,000. As he began rewriting Stalag 17, he envisioned Charlton Heston as the leading man. But as the character evolved, he became more and more cynical, so he asked William Holden to see the play. Well, the first Holden found it less than exciting. In fact, he walked out after the first act, but Wilder was able to talk him into waiting for a finished script before making a final decision on the project, well, it was worth the wait. Here's William Holden in his Oscar-winning performance in Stalag 17. <laughs> 